When using Google Search, you can use symbols or words in your search to make your results more precise. Let's take a look at some common search techniques using symbols and Boolean operators. First, you can search by file type. So you can just, in your search box, type file type colon, and then you put the type that you would like to look for. So for example, we might want to look for a PDF. And then after that, we type in our search term. So let's look for a PDF of Dublin, Ohio. Here you'll see that after each result, it says PDF. That tells me these are all PDFs about Dublin, Ohio. I can then open any of them up. So I can search a dollar amount and then search, for example, camera, and it'll show me the most popular cameras priced between four and five hundred dollars. I can also search by hashtags and that will search social media. So I could do hashtag Google Classroom. And I'll find what people are talking about on Twitter about Google Classroom. If I want, I can exclude words from my search. So I might want to look for Jaguar speed, but I don't want it to search car. So for that, I'm going to do the minus sign car, and then I'm going to search for Jaguar speed. And here I have results that are not about cars, but that are about animals. If I want to search for an exact phrase, I'll include that inside quotation marks. So I may want to search for the tallest building. And I want the words tallest and building to be next to each other. When I do that, my search results will all include the words tallest and building next to each other and exactly as typed. If I want to combine searches, I would use the OR Boolean operator. So I may want to search for a marathon or a race. It's important that you have the Boolean operator in all caps, so the word OR should be in caps. Now when I search, I'm going to find things about marathons or races.